Hello Python programmers. So in this video, I'm going to show you that I can create a Python program which will take input as a phone number and then return that from which country that phone number belongs and what is the network service provider for that phone number basically. Okay, so first of all, let's see what is the system requirement. You need only one external package to be installed called phone numbers. So just go to the command prompt and write pip install phone numbers phone numbers and press enter and there you can see it's showing that requir that requirement is already satisfied because I have already installed this package but you have to install this so with this being said let's get to editor and start writing a code Okay, so first of all, what you need to do is create a test.py file. Uh, let me show you where it is. A test.py file and then create a variable in that called number and save a specific phone number in that uh, file which you want to search. Okay, so now let's import our library. First of all, we need to import our phone numbers library. Phone numbers. Uh, phone numbers, yes. Then we'll import our test python file. And actually, we'll do from test. From test import numbers this is the name of our variable and then from phone uh, sorry phone numbers we will import geocoder so that we can uh, locate our phone number so geocoder then let's start coding so this program will have two part first to know that from which country that phone number belongs and second the service provider so let's start with first number so let's write ch number and then phone numbers dot pass and then we'll write that variable name here numbers and then ch here now i really don't know that why we are writing ch here i have gone through the documentation of this phone numbers package and it is also very unclear that why are we using ch here like we have seen that uh, like it has clearly explained that this are used for languages like uh, en is english fr is french it is uh, is i guess italian but they haven't specified that what is this ch so if anybody knows this then comment down below because i also want to know that what are these values like what is this ch what is this ro what is this gb i am really confused about this okay so if you know that please comment down below so we have created that uh, ch number variable now we'll print out that from which country our uh, phone number belongs so we'll write description for number this is the command which will display that uh, what is the location and the language used here is English you can uh, write any language like this is I guess Dutch uh, I don't know this is French this is Italian you can specify any language that you want we want English here so we will write English let's save this and run our code and I guess we are having an error okay it cannot uh, import numbers because this is number okay there should be number here the variable name is number so let's save this and let's run this again and there you can see it's printing India because the number is Indian 
it's my number <laughs> okay now we need to import one more class of this phone numbers library which is called carrier to know that what is the uh, network provider or service provider for that phone number so from phone numbers we need to import the carrier I guess this is the right spelling yeah so we'll write uh, service number and then phone numbers dot pass just a second pass and number and once again I don't know what this RO is then we'll print carrier dot name for number and then we'll write service number comma and then the language that uh, we want this to be so, okay so let me try to explain you a bit here that what is happening so first of all we are using two classes of this phone number library this phone number library has has uh, many classes in built in 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 this for different tasks first we have uh, imported geocoder to know that what is the uh, location for that specific phone number then we have imported the carrier package to know that what is the service provider for that specific phone number okay so let's run this and see whether it's running perfectly or not and okay so it's working perfectly i am using airtel now let me change the number and see that everything is working fine or not and i will edit this because i don't want to show my number on youtube okay so i have changed my number let's see and it started okomo one of my oldest phone number so we know that it's working fine okay so and do not forget to mention your country code like for india it's plus 91 91 sorry <laughs> so when you're writing your phone number mention your country code also so this is it for this video it was a short video and i just found out about this library when i was scrolling the reddit so i just thought why not create a short video on this okay so this is it and i'll meet you in my next lecture bye bye